why would a modern developer look at mainframe? One of the, the reasons that we wanted to do the Zoe project was that when you look at the mainframe through the lens of Zoe, it looks like nothing that you wouldn't expect it to. You can use it through Visual Studio Code. It looks like a file system. Uh, you can access uh, containers on it. You can access the Linux environment. Ironically, I have a little side story, which is I remember working with somebody, and he was in their 20s, and he came to me about a week after he'd been working on the Zoe project, and he said, I'm really annoyed because I haven't been working with the mainframe. And I said, well, what do you mean? And he said, oh, I go to, well, I see all the movies, and everybody hacks the mainframe, and it's all a bunch of green screen, and all I saw was a bunch of really modern tooling where I'm just dragging and dropping everything around. When do I get to see the mainframe? I'm like, dude, you've been working on it. Right, so, and I, was, I saw you chuckle, because it's a kind of a good news story there. So, but the reason that you would do computing on the mainframe is because it's very, very secure, it's very, very reliable, it's very, very fast, and the mainframe's customers, I'm gonna get the number wrong, so apologies, um, but it's about, it's certainly in the 70s to 80% of all of the world's financial data, you know, your bank balance, everything to do with credit cards is held on the mainframe computing platform. Right. It's a very, very large number. It's used by a huge number of Fortune 5 companies. And I saw I don't have all the data, so I won't try and get it wrong by quoting it wrong, but it's all out there. Um, so you can have a very, very good career instantly working with these very, very large enterprise customers who have money to spend, who are doing some very exciting things with IT. They want to get, new, get to new markets. They want to get to mobile payments. They want to get to micropayments. Uh, you know, they, they want to get more... Um, you know, branch into new geographies. They also have lots of challenges through GDPR, Adora, uh, data breach. We've seen open source uh, uh, um, supply chain has been an attack vector recently. XZ is very high profile. It just occurred what, a few weeks ago. So again, all of these customers are embracing open source and new tech, but they want to make sure they don't let their customers down. It's a very exciting field. It's intellectually challenging.